Would you rise on your feet wherever you are and begin to speak in the Holy Ghost? Rata Kataya, Elepere Kotosea, Erabadaya, Elepete Kataya, Eshamana Kada, Arapata Kata, Eli Katasha, Erebelekete, Esekola, Erabalata, Eshamanaka, Amalatokose, who says a thing and it comes to pass when the Lord has not commanded it? Lekoresha, Esepete, Arabalaya. A Korasi, a Lemenekate, a Shadaya, a Labalaka, a Rotokose, a Labalaya, a Shadia. Lift up your right hand wherever you are and declare, Say, right now, Say, right now, right now, whatsoever that has gone out of order, whatsoever that has gone out of order in my life, right now. I command you align, 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 align. Open your mouth. I'm a satire. El Rebelekete. I'm a Herodeke. El Labatai. El Shabada. El Labadekete. El Rodai. El Mesede. El Labade. El Mesode. El Lakata. El Mesode. Hear <laughs> Wherever you are sitting right now, whatsoever that is enforcing negativity in my life, whatsoever that is enforcing negativity in my life, right now, break, 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 break. open your mouth, Akata Kata, Ella Berekata, Shapata, Arabalea, Ekarabadesa, Elandekata, Arabalaya, Shapata, Erotoko, Elamenea, Shapada, Alatata, Erodikaya, Elamenekata, Ashapadaya, Elabelaka, Arabala, Eshamanaka, Alabelekata, Ladio Emeton, Alauda. As your amen will resound and your two hands are lifted, hear me as I hear the Lord as Shakata over every issue that has troubled your mind, over every predicament the devil has prolonged. Akata say, and John cried and he said, None was found worthy, Amasaka, to open the seal. And John wept, and one of the elders touched John and said John do not cry the lion of the tribe of Judah has prevailed whatever you are afraid of whatever you are afraid of as your amen will turn it is settled he is set on, he is set on, he is set on, he is set on, he is set on. Your health is set on, your career is set on, your finances is set on. You are set on, you are set on, you are set on, you are set on. Any power that will reawaken, I can't ask your aim, I will turn. I announce they are broken. They are broken, they are broken, they are broken, they are broken. Let your aim and rise, let your aim and rise. Wherever you are set right now, 
right now I enter my settlement I enter I enter I enter right now right now said the doors are open 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 I enter I enter I enter I enter I enter open your mouth and enter I can't touch lift up your head oh you can't lift up your head oh you can't be a lifter be a lifter be a lifter he everlasting doors apartheid and seven let your aim at on Hear me as I hear the Lord over every issue. You are trusting God for divine settlement. On the sound of your amen, I decree a father. A father. A father. A father. A father. A father. For the last time. A father. Release your seven loud, amen. People of God, I'm not sure you had the testimonies the way I had them. You just came back from the hospital. They gave you a report and you had a word of knowledge on NSPPD that says go back and check again. She was scared. How will I go back again? And she said, let me go to another hospital. Something told her, go back to the same hospital. He knew how long the Lord reversed an ugly report. He didn't take time. Who is listening to me? I don't know the ugly report that you showed up here with in five minutes in five minutes in five minutes i don't care to know the ugly report as your amen were thunder they are reversed they are reversed they are reversed they are reversed let your amen rise she said mama said that she said not on my watch not on my watch will my son die and he kept the career oh pure you will not die let me stand on that testimony and speak over your life nothing around you will die whatever the devil is planning to kill i command them resurrect by fire resurrect by fire resurrect by fire resurrect by fire your vision will not die your dream will not die your business will not die your career will not die your children will not die they will not die they will not die they will not die wherever you are let me hear you thunder not on my watch Shout it again, not on my watch. People of God, Jesus, stay here. Open your Bibles very quickly, people of God. For what our God cannot do does not exist. Open your Bibles to the book of Matthew, chapter 9, verse 27. People of God wherever you are today is exactly six months we started church i thought that that scream would be louder to the king of kings last sunday the total number that we're in church last sunday was six thousand three hundred and thirty three persons in six months we have six thousand persons over six thousand persons in church throw your head back scream the way that will anoint the devil you are increasing without boundaries you are breaking out you are breaking forth the oil on this commission is working it's working on your life it's working on your life it's working on your life let your aim and resound Matthew chapter 9 verse 27 Alaba Shadia Matthew Matthew chapter 9 Amen 
Hallelujah. We read the book of Matthew chapter 9, verse 27. Shadi Balahara. And we'll read from verse 27 to verse 31. If you're there, help me say I'm there. Right. Can we read together? Church went to go. And when Jesus departed thence, two blind men followed him, crying and saying, Thou son of David, have mercy on us. And when he was come into the house, the blind man came to him. And Jesus saith unto them, Believe ye that I am able to do this. They said unto him, Yea, Lord. Then touched he their eyes, saying, According to your faith, be it unto you. And their eyes were opened, and Jesus straightly charged them, saying, See that no man know it. But they, when they were departed, spread abroad his fame in all that country. Our Father, we ask in the next few minutes, that you do what no man can do. Father, we ask, O oh God, do what only you can do. Father, we give you all the glory, Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Let your amen thunder louder. That amen is not sounding like you really believe it. Somebody here needs to get an affirmation from you that it is already settled. So before you take your seat, would you help me walk up to seven people and look in their eye and tell them it is settled. Say it like you really mean it. Bashanda kaya, araba le koraba shi na batata, erebele kerebo shande yadaya, irabala tosi yadaya. If you believe it, rabale deya. Let your amen thunder louder. Let your amen crumble the kingdom of darkness. Let your amen hijack the gates of hell. On the way to your seat, can you thunder again? It is settled. Take your seats in the presence of God, people of God. It becomes absolutely interesting as much as it is intriguing that the Bible begins to tell us about these two blind men that met Jesus. And the Bible said uh, they followed Jesus until they came to a particular house. And Jesus began to ask them some questions and then ask them a few questions. Believest thou that I am able to do this? And the blind man said, yes, sir. Yes, sir. We believe. And the Bible said, Jesus said to them, and let it be unto you according to your faith the next thing we hear is that the matter is settled as soon as jesus spoke that word the next thing we hear is that the matter is settled and people of god that is the same way i believe that one word from god to you today is going to settle the matter let me not say too much and enter into the dynamics of divine settlement that we find in this scripture now if this is not the bible i would have said there is an error in this scripture that we just read right now if this wasn't the bible i would have told you there's something that i find very uncomfortable if this wasn't the bible i would have just remarked that there was a part of this narrative that doesn't really make a lot of sense but she but uh, but i believe it's a word for someone under the sound of my voice please would i let me borrow you um uh, bro lawrence and professor please let me borrow the two of you let me borrow or the two of you the bible says uh, that while jesus uh, please uh, uh, begin begin uh, start off from where we started reading from please uh, both of you behind me both of you behind me the bible says when jesus was departed thence uh, that two blind men now right behind me that two blind men look at your neighbor tell your neighbor two blind men uh, you need to get where i am going to as jesus was going two blind men followed him it doesn't sound right the bible did not say that two blind men were led the bible says two blind men followed him holy spirit you see until the Lord brings you to a place that though blind yet you can find your way let me warn you he never said you will have illumination all the way 
He never said he's gonna bright be bright every day. He said, like mama testified, you will wake up one morning and you will get a call that doesn't sound pleasant. That's darkness. You're gonna walk into something that's supposed to be okay, and you wake up that morning and it's not okay. Shaba Daya. Can I still find my way when it is dark? Can I still find my way? If two blind men in the scripture can follow the Lord, even when there was no illumination, Jerry can follow the Lord. I can find my way. If you understand what I'm saying, can you turn that in louder? Amen. If you have walked with the blind or you, you know a thing about blind men, what you need to get this what they don't have for sight they get with sound you need to get this Shabiba. so Lord there are seasons where I can't even see where I'm going to but I'm going to pay attention to what you are seeing so I can't see my settlement what did I say to you about it that is how you can arrive there Lord I don't know what is God. so Lokosha every blind man will tell you that their sense of hearing is a, so the way they are able to blind men you see oh I saw a blind man walking all by himself on the road and then with that stick as they came moving that stick is not where the answer is it is in the sound Shabale Araba Soporodia days I don't even know where I'm going to I don't know how to arrive there my ears are open for my ear will hear a voice from behind you saying this is the way walk in it when you turn to the right and when you turn to the left there are people I came to talk to in second service and the Lord is saying seasons when you can't see watch what you hear I know you can't see but I'm going to take you to your destination with a sound with my voice as your amen will thunder i believe the word i'm about to give you is a word that will launch you to the place of your full expectation as your amen will thunder carry it right now 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 let your amen thunder louder Take your seat. Two blind men that can't see, but they are paying attention to their sound. Lord, I can't see what you said, but I can hear what you are saying. Libo The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the strength of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? So the devil will come and say, but what, what did he, that thing he said, you've not even seen it. So my navigational tool, when I can't see my settlement, becomes what I hear. So I've got to trust your voice. I've got to trust that you're not a man that you should lie. I've got to draw me when my heart is overwhelmed. I will remember every word that you have spoken. I shatter, Elijah. I can't see it, but then again, what I hear is what will take me there. Am I talking to someone? So I came to tell someone the Bible says, For we walk by faith, not by sight. What this means is that there are days you can't see it coming until you get there can i say it again there are days you can't see it coming you wouldn't see the wind you wouldn't see the rain but you're just going to see yourself there there are days you can't see it at those times those are days where you're going to trust he said this to me and any man that has to walk in blindness let me say it this way the bible says jesus 
who for the joy that was set before him endured the cross so anytime it is dark and you want to get to your destination please focus on the destination not on the journey anytime it is dark in your life and you focus on the, the bible say who for the joy that was set before him basha and the other cross so how about she i'm going through a place it, it i see tons around the way but i'm not paying attention i'm paying attention to my death I, I don't have all the time to work this but let me tell you again the bible says looking unto jesus the author and the finisher when it is dark and i can't find my way i look on the person who asked me to start the journey because that is the way to navigate through darkness. My eyes are on him. My eyes are on him. Bashadia, Hebosia, and people of God, because he dwells in an unapproachable light. Bashibadaha, you need to get what I'm about to say, because he himself is light all by himself. But where I am is not illuminated. But when I look at light, I'm able to trace where I am from where he is. Did I confuse you? I'm able to find me from where he is. And so I'm looking where I am looks a little bit dark. But where he is is full of light. So I'm able to connect from here to here. Because I'm focused on light. So I can trace at what point the light started shining. Oh, if I just move a bit step further here. I will walk into the light that emanates from him. When I can find my way. It is not a time to complain. It's a time to become. When I can find where, it's not a time, it's who am I becoming? Who does he want me? He wants me to master the art that others don't have. And that is the art of walking even while it is dark. Because truth is that, soon after now, some people, once there's no light, they will close their market. Say, ah, there's no light. But there are those of us who have mastered the darkness we can make transactions even when there's, there's no light because others will be ah there's no light let all of us walk out no sir he trained me in darkness did you hear what I just said right now this is how two blind men followed Jesus even while it is dark this is how two blind men follow Jesus while it is Jesus never spoke to them while he kept but these guys kept shouting have mercy on us I have never seen anybody cry out for mercy that's why every time we pray mercy prayers on NSPPD the way the answers are very overwhelming I never saw anyone cry out for mercy and Jesus ever overlooked this blind man had only crying and saying thou son of David have mercy on us we are not qualified but have mercy maybe we are our own victims we are the reason why we are where we are but have mercy maybe it's our choices that brought us to where we are maybe we didn't listen to you when you wanted us to listen maybe we wasted our time on what was not important maybe we are inconsistent hear me as I hear the Lord everyone under the sound of my voice who is saying to God show me mercy in an area of your life as your amen will thunder in five days time I don't know the area where you are depending on God for mercy in five days time receive mercy for settlement you did not hear me receive mercy for settlement 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 receive mercy for settlement, receive mercy for settlement. let your amen rest let your name and resound by the mercies of God carry your divine settlement carry your divine settlement carry your divine settlement carry your divine settlement let your name and turn the louder take your seat Shinda Balaha Pariyadasada mercy is looking for the unqualified 
Mercy is looking for those who are saying, Pastor, don't even talk any further. I can't get it. By the way, Pastor, I'm too flawed to be anyone. I'm, I'm too, I'm too, I'm too much of a hypocrite to see the mercies of God, to see, to see his hand in my life. Hear me as I hear the Lord. The Bible says, goodness and mercy will follow you like i said Bush, every time he wants to show you his goodness he first of all shows mercy because it's a cycle this is why he said to moses sorry that i'm talking about i'm, I'm, I'm messy right now he says to moses moses he said i will cause my goodness to pass before you he said to moses i will cause my goodness to pass before you and then that is when you're going to see a bit of me and the bible said he said and i will then have mercy on whom i will have mercy this qualification for his goodness is not because you prayed there are more powerful prayer warriors than you qualification for his goodness is not because you did everything right never wake up any morning without first of all lifting up your hands and saying lord show me mess let my life be about your mercy lift up your two hands wherever you are thunder with a loud voice say oh lord show me mercy if you understand it can you say louder amen let your amen resound and the bible says as jesus began to go very quickly the bible says as jesus arrived the house of this man at this particular person where the miracles and the signs and wonders took place the bible said when he was come into the house these blind men who have been following came to him and jesus said unto them let us now agree on this believe ye that i'm able to do this they said unto him yea lord yes lord he said do you believe that i'm able to settle this matter today do you believe that i'm able to turn it around simple as it may sound it was tied to their belief amazing as it may look it was tied to their belief there was a miracle that was about to happen and jesus was asking them do you believe that i am able to do this and they answered yes lord show me the next verse if you don't mind show me the next verse the bible say then he touched their eyes and still saying according to your faith be it unto you the bible says he touched their eyes and said so sir let me say this very clearly do you believe who is believing huh? they are the ones that are supposed to believe and then he says to them according to your faith let it be so unto you that means the capacity for their change was where was in them so the capacity for their change was not with the lord was with them so sir the more they grow themselves the more they will grow the attention of the lord i wish i can break it further so the truth is that the capacity for their becoming for their transition for the change was inside of them the devil is scared when your faith rises the devil is scared when you are become ah shadiba there are women when you call on the phone and tell them your son is about to die they will lose concentration they will fall on the floor they will start rolling everywhere but i love the way nsppd is building faith mama said obiora for what that obiora is looking like ice fish they do, obviously the daughter would have told her say his, his body is cold he's dead and all that there are women who are saying you can't give me that that is not what i prayed about that is not what so you find out the capacity to make a change lies within you and this was where jesus said be it unto you according to your word people of God the Bible says the next verse he touched their eyes saying um, and their, the Bible say and their eyes were opened can I pray for you whatever you may return back people of God you may go back as your two hands are lifted to God and as your amen will thunder whatever that needs to open in your life 
<laughs> you better mark these words and take them very seriously whatever that needs to open in your life in 48 hours as your amen will thunder i command them to open right now let them open right now that new door that needs to open uh, that business investment that needs to open uh, that door for your children uh, that needs to open uh, it will not be more than 48 hours uh, as your amen will turn uh, I command it to swing open right now let it open let it open 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 let the testimony start right now doors that you have forgotten doors that you have forgotten doors that you have forgotten i command them to open right now Open Rhino, open Rhino, open Rhino, open Rhino. Let your aim at on the three times. Somebody turn now open by fire. Open by fire, 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 open by fire. Let your aim at sound. take your seat let me say this last thing and we'll be going to be done i don't know who you are but that door is already open you didn't hear me i said that door is already open before 6 p.m today may you receive an evidence that that door has opened the last time they said no but this time around they are saying a big yes you saw rejection the last time but the lord is turning it around i say it is already open it's already open they are going to ask you where have you been where have you been where have you been i announced the door is already open the door is already open the door is already open let your amen resound take your seat for one second the bible says show me the next verse Ashida, divine settlement this is this is where I love no um, before that before that verse 30 yes the Bible says and their eyes were opened and Jesus straightly charged them saying see that no man know it you know what this means don't tell anybody about this by the next verse 31 but they when they were departed spread abroad his fame in all that child so they, they, they disobeyed jesus they disobeyed jesus eh? so they disobeyed jesus they didn't disobey jesus let me tell you let me tell you let me tell you you have been a blind man all your life i want you to be checking this out you everybody knows you as a blind man and then as you're coming home you see, this what does Uncle Emeka look like? Where does it? Where is his house in this? And people are looking. At, hey, there are miracles you don't explain. They explain themselves. There are miracles you don't introduce. There are things you don't say. Look at what God is doing. Can I talk to 50 persons under the sound of my voice? You see, this week you have entered. You see, this week you have entered. God will give you miracles that will explain themselves. You will not tell anybody, but they will hear about it. They will spread the fame of Jesus. They will spread the supernatural. They will spread the supernatural. Receive it right now. Receive it right now. Receive it right now. It will explain itself. It will explain itself. It will be a talking miracle. It will be a vibrating miracle. It will speak for itself. Carry it right now. 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 Can you? Amen. Thunder seven times.